Hey y'all, welcome back. Today I will be preparing my tools for some yard work. I have my pruners over here, my handy pruners. These are my favorites. I have a few, but these are my favorite pruners. And I have my favorite lopplers. Uh, these lobster, lopplers actually I purchased from, from um, Aldi's <laughs> uh, a few years ago, but I was gonna show you something. These things are so amazing. Uh-oh. Oh, I was gonna show you. Guess I won't. Guess I won't be showing you. But I wanted to show you something very special. Guess I won't be. I don't know why is why is it acting like that? Ugh. I'm trying to extend it. This is an extending lockler. These extend. Yeah, they're a little, they're a little rusty. Boom. As you can see, they extend. And I think I haven't really had to use them extended um, since last year, but that probably was around this same time. And I did not put them away and store them properly and that could be the reason why they were so stiff anyways i am here and i wanted you to just uh come along with me or i guess watch while i prepare my tools to be used all right let's get started
right, well that wraps up the full cleaning process of how I prepare my tools for my gardening and pruning. You guys, that, that was a little tough, especially with these wafflers. All right, y'all, we're all done. Wafflers are clean and ready. I don't know if you could tell in that close-up cleaning that uh, there was rust that kept coming out when I tried to do the extensions. When I did the extensions for these wafflers, it was so tough. See how easy, how much easier it is now? And there was so much rust. I tried to see if I could get that rust. There is supposed to be some hesitancy because you don't want them to just be sliding out. But the way how I was trying my best to get those, uh, get these extenders out is not how it's supposed to be. So uh, I hope that's a lesson that you don't have to actually endure. Uh, but yeah, this is definitely essential for maintaining your property and the trees that you're um, growing. Uh, maintenance uh, is a part of their growth. You know, we can concentrate on the roots. We can concentrate on the fruit. But if we do not protect and maintain our, uh, our trees and the things that we are seeking to harvest from, then they are susceptible to any kind of damage or disease or pest. So um, yeah, I hope this video was helpful for you. If you're anything like me, having someone do it, watching them do it actually is very helpful. Uh, I don't know all the time if I'm always using the correct products. You may have some products that you may uh, think is much better these have worked for me for years. This is basically penetrating oil, which a lot of people call liquid wrench. Well, it's actually called liquid wrench. Uh, and a lot of people use this when they are trying to eliminate rust. Of course, there are other things like WD-40, things like that. This is just wrap, rubbing alcohol that we use, you know, for your muscles and stuff like that. But it helps me sanitize and sterilize rather. Uh, and then this is one of my best friends because I already have stainless steel potware, pots and panware. I have lots of things called uh, with bars keepers friends. This is just my favorite type of thing to use um, when I'm using, when I'm trying to get my tools clean. I like to use bar keeper friend. I don't know what all is in the properties of this, but uh, it actually says on here, it removes rust, lime, stains, and tarnish. And y'all, this, this stuff is good, even for your uh, cleaning your bathroom and cleaning your kitchen, and stuff like that. It tells you the type of products that is best to use on, which is copper, tile, ceramic, stainless steel, porcelain, things like that. Um, but, you know, read the labels on your own. Of course, these pads that I purchased, that you saw me use, I purchased them from uh, Dollar Tree. These are called the Brillo brillo cleaning pads these are su supposedly reusable um i have never reused them um but i may just try to reuse them but i hope that this video was great for you if you like it absolutely hit that like button and if you love to see more of it please subscribe until next time so long y'all bye